Welcome to another video tutorial about the Locus Map app, this time about the basics of route planning. If you need to plan your trip exactly as you want it, i.e. not just as the shortest route from point A to point B, the Route Planner is your tool. The Route Planner is primarily launched from the main menu of features. However, if you're already working through the routes in the Route Manager and decide to create a new route, click the Add Route button and the planner will be offered as an option. Each route consists of points connected by segments. We call them the shaping points because they define the shape of the route. You add or remove them by the plus and minus buttons. The way the segment between them is drawn is defined by the routing profile. You choose the profile in the drawing mode menu. You have a wide range to choose from, including the manual mode for drawing off roads and paths. All your editing steps can be easily undone or redone. The map controls are on the right. Zooming buttons, centering, and a button opening the content panel in which you can change the map or other displayed layers. The easiest way of the route drawing is by tapping the shaping points directly on the map. When you need to place the point more accurately, shift the cursor to the location and use the adding button. If you want to change the course, shift the shaping point or remove it. The selected profile determines how the router chooses types of roads ascend angles, and many other parameters. According to these, the route is drawn between shaping points automatically. If you come across a place not covered by the routing data or that lays off roads, use the manual mode. In this case, only a straight line is drawn. The bottom bar shows the route length, raw estimation of time on the route, and elevation gain or loss. Tapping the chart button slides up the elevation chart and charts of way types and surfaces. Tapping any of them centers the map screen on the place on the route. The charts change simultaneously according to your route editing. It happens that you don't like your creation as a whole. Rather than undo all your steps one by one, just clear the planner screen from the route menu. When your route is ready, you can save it to a folder. Open the route menu and tap Save. If you forget to do so, by default, the route will remain in the planner for later editing.